is today, Sam? 28th. 28th? Well, happy birthday to those who have birthdays on the 28th, and we got a whole bunch of them. So we're going to get right to it. In a little bit, we're going to talk about a toothache and maybe what you want to do with it, but uh, let's do some birthdays. Um, Kyler Dreiling. Dreiling? Dreiling? Kyler. Happy birthday. Oh, Curtis Ingroff. Happy birthday, Curtis. Madison Height. Uh, and Donna Peterson. Happy birthday to you guys. And we've got a ton of Facebook friends here. See if I can still read. This. Oh, who's first on the list? Facebook friends. My sister-in-law. Yes, Heather Long. There she is. Happy birthday, Heather. Uh, then we've got Kelly Vance. Uh, knew her when I was in college at PSU. Happy birthday, Kelly. And uh, Kim Longpine. She's also a patient. So happy birthday to you, Kim. Uh, Kimmy Joe Thomas. Happy birthday to Kimmy Joe. Uh, and then this is. Uh, uh, a guy that was on uh, uh, Biggest Loser, won the Biggest Loser, uh, Matt Hoover. And uh, he married one of the contestants. And then my good buddy, uh, Terry Watson, down in Arkansas, <coughs> excuse me, they uh, they came down and helped him promote some events down at the office. And and uh, they became friends and kind of, through the grapevine, I heard a lot about them. And, and uh, so happy birthday to you, Matt. Uh, and then some of my good buddies from from church, uh, Mia Elliott. I give Mia an awful hard time, and and she's gotten to where she can pretty much take it uh, without just you know. All you got to do is tease her about her boys, and, and I just push every button she's got, and, and you know just and I just go I just smile. Happy birthday, Mia. Uh, Tom Keckley. Uh, he's over there in uh, Carl Junction. Known Tom for a lot of years. And, uh, happy birthday to Tom. Uh, Vip Patel, he's a dentist uh, back east, and I've, I've known him through some organizations I've been in. Happy birthday, Vip. And then a, a girl who's a little younger than me in school here, uh, uh, but it was Sherry Grant. And uh, But it's uh, i got to get the name right now because all these people got married 20 years ago. Uh, Sherry Reeser, so happy birthday to you, Sherry. It's, it was good to find you on Facebook. It's good to see you. And uh, her birthday's tomorrow. And another birthday tomorrow is uh, Marie Wright. And then we've got a couple on Saturday, Corey Klingen uh, and uh, Millie Cluxton. So happy birthday to a whole bunch of uh, people today. Uh, uh, we'll move to the, uh, the question of the day. The question is of the day, what, I guess this probably came in here not too long ago because the way it's worded. But uh, my tooth is killing me. What is the first step I should take to get this taken care of? Well, come see somebody. Come see somebody that can take an x-ray of the, of the tooth, uh, take a look at it uh, real close and see what's going on. A lot of different things can be going on, especially this time of year. Sinuses can be uh, making a tooth feel like it hurts. Um, a cracked tooth, you know, uh, can really make it feel like it hurts. Decay can make it feel like it hurts. Usually, if it feels, if it hurts, that's it's meant that it's moving along, and, and whatever's doing it is at a point where there's really got to be something done. Um, the only thing, exception, maybe sinuses, to where we figure that's what it is. But uh, if it's cracked and fractured, or has a big decay in it, or something like that, and causing it to hurt. We've got to get right on it uh, and check it out. Um, most of the time, we'll numb things up and go into it and, and see what we find. Um, some of the times, we're looking at a root canal or having a tooth out if the tooth is, is uh, if the decay is deep enough into the into the tooth. So the first step is to make the phone call. That's the first step, and then the second step is to drag yourself into one of our offices and and get it taken taken care of. A lot of times uh, teeth get to a point where they hurt because people don't like being here and uh, and they, they've let something go uh, just like any of us do. We deny that something could be wrong and it finally reaches a point where you've got to do something and, and so the, the biggest thing on having a tooth hurt is to not let it get to that point in the first place. So you know maybe try to every now and then actually have uh, one of us take a look at something for you. So uh, so what is this beautiful scene, Sam? Well, I thought since the bad weather was coming, it might be kind of nice to 
you get like palm trees and yeah. beaches. Is it really? Yeah, it, not all that. It's uh, like the Gold Canyon, some of it. The what canyon? <laughs> What? Grand Canyon. The, I thought you said the Gold Canyon. <laughs> I think I did. I'm having a Gold Canyon candle party in a couple months. What is that? It's is a, that brand like a brand of candles. Name? Yeah. Oh, so this is like a video. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that is pretty. Okay. Well, you get a chance. Go to that. And uh, those of you who are experienced the beautiful day in Southeast Kansas that we're having uh, tonight, maybe try to get inside and lay low, start a fire, and uh, have hot chocolate because it's going to get not very pleasant. So. Have a great day and we'll and we'll see you next week.